Okay. So I'm here with my friend David Belo. Hello. David has his own channel, and it's called Thunder Nugget. Well, that's the name. That's the name we want. No, it's just called David Belo. Uh, <laughs> I, do, I do a series called Thunder Nugget. It's where I drive my smart car. It's sort of funny. But okay. uh, yeah, yeah, it's um, the channel's called David Belo, and uh, yeah, you can find it by searching my name, uh, D A V I D B E E L O W. All right, and David is tech savvy. I'm not technical savvy. He gives me a lot of tips and hints, Absolutely. and we decided we would do a video together, For and sure. just a just a short intro, and so um, and hopefully he'll introduce me on his absolutely at, on his uh, video because we're filming. He's filming, and I'm filming it all at the same time. Right. So uh, this is a uh, frugal uh, Willie May. Uh, Willie May. Mm -hmm. uh, she has some really cool videos. She does uh, cooking, um, saving money, um, um, prepping, uh, home defense, self-defense. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> survival. What, survival. Uh, I do a lot of survival. A, what was a lightning survival video? That was excellent. Um, you better watch out if she has a broom in her hand. You, you <laughs> might be in trouble. Um, or an extension cord. That's true. Mm -hmm. Anything that I could grab up, Anything. if I'm being attacked, I'm mm -hmm. going to fight back. So, bef <laughs> yeah, before she got here, we, we hid the brooms. I, I got rid of all, all sharp objects, so, <laughs> so I feel safe. <laughs> mm -hmm. But anyway, so we're together. We're outside yeah, of his day. business, and yeah, uh, we've got a real good backdrop and for this time of year. So just wanted to introduce you to David. Yeah. And um, I, I really do look forward to meeting some of y'all. Um, I know some of the people that are watching my channel have been uh, watching hers and uh, really enjoyed the content. And I hope that we can do some more stuff in the future. Yeah, I really I, do. I look I, we forward can, to that. We can do some fun stuff. Uh, we've got to do. We've got to do another survival video, though. Right. I'm telling you, we have to. <laughs> survival, and I don't know. Do you cook? Absolutely not. Okay, so I, I need cook. to show you how to cook. Yeah, I need to learn how to cook. You need, I, to, I need cook to cook outdoors on a survival video. You've got to know how to cook. We don't know what's going to happen. We, we don't. do not the way know. Things and are going, it's crazy. It's scary times right now. It's so, scary. you know, um, you may not always have McDonald's or Chick fil A. Or you know, I don't even have a kitchen. So I might have to cook outside. <laughs> you um, might. Most, uh, I think all the last you meal need, I cooked was outside. All you need is a little round plug-in type thing to heat up. So well, I got one of those, like a like a hot plate. Yeah, See, a I got hot one plate. of those. You could cook on that. You know, you, know, um, you can cook a six-course meal if you wanted it. <laughs> you might think I'm joking, but I cooked a steak on a pizza cooker the other night. On what? On a pizza cooker, a little thing that spins oh, around. Oh, yeah, it was. It, it was great. It was fantastic. It that's actually right. was really good. See, you're um, thinking outside the that's box. Right. That's how you survive. That's, what, that's why we're friends. That's how you survive. All you need now is one of those um, oh, solar panels so that and, and all the hookups where you can just plug the small appliances in and cook on that well i mean as you as you know we both do youtube i need a i, I need like a whole solar array to run all the equipment and stuff did you oh, no no man. i'm saying i would need one oh, i would, you would. Need one. Oh, well, see, wouldn't you, you for your computer that. and all your stuff yeah well, but i guess if the power grid failed then we probably wouldn't be worrying about youtube anymore would we no yeah that's <laughs> and i saw right. an article about that that we might lose the power grid in the future and that thought sort of bothered right. me but you know what the way you handle that, you may not have the YouTube, but you do have books, hard copy books that tell you how to. Now's the time to collect them, and you can find those at Goodwill, thrift stores. There's a used bookstore downtown. Most cities have that. Um, you know what would be my luck? I would probably finally get monetized on YouTube, and then that's when the energy grid would fail. <laughs> no, that's negative. David, we are always positive right. on our YouTube. <laughs> always positive. Are we? <laughs> <laughs> we are. <laughs> You've got to get that really mindset. Though? You Maybe have do, got to get problem. that mindset. Look, you know, I've got 500 subscribers now. And it only and took me 11 congratulations. years. Congratulations. I'm not quite there yet, but oh, I will be. Um, you were, you were going to get there so fast. Uh, your content's fantastic. It is well, absolutely, it, it's informative, that. it's positive, it is fun, it's funny. Um, it is, it is absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Um, 
So I, I can I, can I go grab something? I brought something from home that I want to know if you what you could do with it, like in a survival situation. Like if you had like like from a for a self defense, could I, can I go grab it real quick? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. All right. All right. So David has his survival item that he has at his home. So okay. he's brought that in. So, so show me what you brought in. I will. Um, I don't want you to see it just yet. So I was watching um, her uh, self defense at home video, which was fantastic, and uh, she showed how you know chopsticks, screwdrivers, hammers, knives, extension cords brooms, even a ceiling fan duster um, could be used. So I brought one of the most obscure items I could find. I want to see I want to see um, what uh, Willie May here can uh, do with this. All right, so let me grab this. Okay. Are you ready? Ready. All right. So if you're, if you're in, in your house and you get someone's coming after you, what could you do with oh this? Oh my gosh, that is a perfect thing. You take this thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you take that thing and you wham them. Right upside the head? Right upside the head. Throw it if you have to. If they're coming at you with like a knife, you want to throw that. <laughs> wow. Um, so like, you so you would you would use it as like a club? Yeah. Like like this? Exactly. See, I no, I thought for now, sure you would be going for something like this. Well, you could I do you that also. I thought you would the face with this and like get a couple eyes or something. Depends on whether they have a knife. So if they have a knife, would you? And like, I would probably, I would. That would be my best shot to throw that. And it sounds violent, but no, I'm not I mean, a violent I mean, person. If they're coming at you with violence, you know, you know, eye for an eye, right? Um, <laughs> well, not exactly like that. You just want to defend yourself. We have that right. For sure. For you sure. you Absolutely. defend yourself whatever the whatever way that you possibly can. So, Absolutely. but that's perfect. Yeah. So you you would feel safe with this if someone's coming after you. You'd feel confident. It, I'd safe. I'd be, feel safe with anything I could throw. Now, if they have a gun. I'm gonna duck. <laughs> I may be able to to slow them down a little bit if I throw that. Disorient them a little and, bit. And hopefully I have my gun to where I can uh, grab that. You pretty good with a gun? Yeah, very good. Oh my goodness. Well, you, you better watch out. <laughs> well, you better leave her alone. Okay. Well, that was interesting. That's it. Took, it took her uh, about half a second to come up. She was like, perfect. Well, you you've got to be quick. I mean, you're shocked if somebody's coming after you to do you harm. And if they've broken into your house, they're going to do you harm. I mean, well, yeah, I mean, if know. they've already forced their way into your home, you have yeah. no choice but so to, you you know, have to take to care do, of them. Yeah, you have things next to the door that you can grab, uh, whatever you can do because you're not expecting it, but you think outside the box and you hope and pray you never have to use it. Hope and pray that For you sure. never have absolutely, to. absolutely. I mean, that, and that's why I don't want to harm anybody, but I'm you, not going to be harmed. Either. You're all about being prepared. Yeah. And you have some really great advice and tips that I've never even thought about. Like I did not know how to survive a, a lightning strike. I do now. Yeah. Um, I did not. I did not. I, I didn't know how to survive with a pineapple. I do now. See? <laughs> you, you, you want to you want to use this? Hey, so it's so we're, we're going to throw like this. <laughs> or you know, would you snap this off and maybe use this as like a like maybe a little something to come after their faces. You're just, you're just throwing the whole thing. Well, you could. Whole... Hey, it's two survival things. You eat it to survive, and you throw it if you have to. See? Look, you can take care of the intruder and then have a delicious That's salad right. afterwards. <laughs> While you're waiting on the police to come right. along, and you've Just... got some other thing that if he raises up, you can bonk him in the head a little bit, and, and you're Look, good. You, 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 you toss <laughs> it, okay? You throw it. You hit the assailant, then you. you well, I don't want to finish him off. I just uh, want to stop him until the just, police can get there. Okay. Yeah, I don't. I don't really want to harm anybody. Well, you, you could. You could. You could stop the crime in progress. There you go. See, there you go. See, I, I was. And I. Nine one one. They come really, really quick. And the reason I know is my iPhone. I accidentally call and can't always get the phone out of my pocket, and I've had them come to my house within I'm gonna say less than three minutes so they're if, at my house checking out are you uh, okay she, <laughs> well I have enjoyed talking have with too. you it's David and I appreciate all the information you give me on the technical side Absolutely. of things and I hope you have a good rest of the day well, and thank you. everybody watching I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day and may God bless you and keep you and may his face shine upon you this day. Yep. And bye-bye.